out, you guys. Give me one second. Let me share this out. Turn this down a little bit so we don't get um, copyright. <laughs> We're in trouble by music. All right. So I'm going to go in here and share this out. And then I also need to make a post real quick. Say hello when you jump on. We're just going to do hair. Hair tutorial. A little bit. Kind of. Um, to show you how to how I use the Primrose Styler. You're on late. Oh, yeah. Um, I was folding clothes. And I still have laundry to do and stuff. But I'm actually going to just like put my laundry and stuff in in my hamper and then fold tomorrow but um did a lot of laundry I was busy hi Chelsea got um busy 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 lately all right hold on let me see if I can I think I just need to do it on my story so that weird hello how are you can you guys hear this music or no All right, so I'm going to first go through my hair a little bit with my Conair brush because this is a um, Conair detangler brush. I actually have a regular also. This is my Conair regular, which I need to clean it out again. But this is my regular. No music? You don't? Oh, you don't hear it? Okay. We'll see. Can y'all hear it now or no? Um, so this is the regular and this is the detangler. But this is for wet and dry. So, and this is just for dry hair. So I'm going to use this one for, because this is what I use for after shower. Go through. It detangles and goes through my hair. It's a little wet still. I usually like tap my towel a couple different times to kind of dry it. But lately, I haven't been doing too much because I've been using that in styler. And you guys, this is so good. I love it. It's so good. I was like, holy crap. Yeah, I can hear it now. Okay, good. As long as you can hear me over the music and everything and you hear the music, though, you're good. It should be fine. We'll see. We'll see if it ends up, like, deleting it. I'm going to laugh if it does, but it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. I want to listen to music, and I know that... Like, um, a lot of times you can, you just gotta, um, put, like, I don't on rights and stuff, which I can fix that later. It's fine. It's fine, it's fine. As long as you can hear me, it's fine. One second. I'm also, I'm just using the Pandora app to listen to music. So I'm gonna skip this song. And now it's on a commercial! It's okay. So anyway, we're just going to brush out through my hair to make sure all these knots are out of my hair. Sometimes I also use the brush function on that, but um, I mostly do that after. After I go through my hair with that. Because what that does is it's got heat to it. I don't want to hear this song either. I'm on my thumbprint radio is what I'm... We'll see if I end up changing it. Most of the time I do. Let's see. Ooh, that's a good one. Stand by you. Alright, probably won't be able to hear it in a few minutes, but that's okay. Alright, so we're going to go through, and this is the... This is the, um... What is it? The, uh... Shoot, what do they call this? This is one of the, uh... One of the one of the things so pieces I guess the way I want to say but there's a brush piece with this and there is um this one that would create really pretty waves I still have to figure this one out but um but this is the one I use and the brush one is the one I use the most I use both these but this is the one that I use right after my hair is completely wet y'all it's completely wet okay 
Alright, ready? I put on high. I let it sit for a few seconds so that way it gets nice and hot. And then I go in and I go through my hair. And I'm not afraid of burning myself either. Which is crazy because usually I would be. Sometimes I go a little slow. That way I make sure the heat is getting in the hair. And already I can feel like it's already getting warm. Okay, see that? I'm going to go in in a couple times, especially because it's just warming up. So yeah, it's starting to warm up and stuff, so then... You guys, this is completely warm now. I'm going to go in. It does take a little bit getting used to, but it's really good. And this is on high. I don't put it on low, I let it do high because it doesn't get like super, super hot. Like it will on around here, but with the bristles, it doesn't get like severely hot where you're gonna burn yourself. That's my soil with it. My bad. But like this is already getting dry. And I need to like pull it from the side sometimes too. Because if you watch it, it'll kind of curve my hair just a little bit. I haven't done it, like I haven't used it for like curling yet, but I probably will sometimes. I think you have to wait till the hair is all dry to get it like completely curled though. But yeah, this is complete, like this is pretty dry now. It's almost fully dry. It's the ends that always are a little harder to get. But it's working well. But you see a big difference between over here and over here. And it doesn't like, how do I say it? Like it doesn't feel like it's pulling your hair at all when you like pull out and stuff of the hair. So it's a dryer and a curler on one right now. But it's just not curling my hair because my hair's not dry. I just kind of curl it up. It's not pretty, but it shines up your hair too. Y'all, this is at Walmart. And it comes with this one, this one, and this one for like waves. So Walmart, 
Um, I'm trying to remember what the price was, but I think it was like thirty nine, maybe. It was thirty nine. No, it was thirty four. That's what it was. Cause I was actually surprised it was thirty four. Cause there's some other ones too there. Um, I just really love Canair brand. That's just my opinion. I really love them. Obviously, I have freaking this. I have the little wet dry brush from there. Did y'all know I replaced my wet and dry one? And then I also have my Tangler one that I swear by. Because I have difficult hair, and most of the time with my hair, I cannot find a brush that's not going to pull my hair um, really hard or anything. Um, even if I don't have like really tangles in my hair, my hair is so sensitive, so um, yeah, it doesn't like it. Hi Arlene, how are you? Yeah, y'all, I'm only doing hair and chatting with you guys because Ray told me um, he wants to go to sleep tonight. He has trouble sleeping without me, so, and he misses his cuddles. I actually didn't go to bed last night with him um, because I accidentally fell asleep on the time. <laughs> so, <laughs> he's like, you better be in bed. <laughs> I'm like, I know. I'm like, I won't do makeup because I know if I do makeup, y'all, I'll be on here for hours. Or on here long enough and stuff. What's happening with this out there? I'm grand. Oh, are you? Why are you so grand, girl? Yeah, y'all see that? Look at that. Hold on. Like, you guys can tell a difference between the really, really wet hair and, like, the good where it's, like, starting to get dry. That's why I'm still awake. My husband is gone for the night. <laughs> Allison. <laughs> Hi, Allison. How are you? That's funny. Does your husband have trouble sleeping too? That's how my husband is. He's always been that way. He actually for the longest time would not be able to sleep. And he would never sleep well. And then me and him got together and started having sleepovers. And uh, he started actually sleeping well. And now like ever since he always has like better sleep when I'm next to him. Because my husband used to sleep with um, a lot of nights. <laughs> it was a, he's got a security issue with it. So he used to sleep with a bunch of nights and stuff like that. And uh, he doesn't do it anymore. Because he's got me now, so. Look at that! Just can't sleep tonight. Oh yeah, Arlene. It's hard to sleep without someone when you're so used to it. Oh no, I'm the one who has trouble sleeping, especially when he is gone. Aww. Yeah, you know what's funny? I'm the opposite. <laughs> I can like, um, usually, most of the time, I, I actually stay up late because I'm a night owl and I just can't sleep, so I stay in bed and just lie there. And then, um, when he goes to work, then I crash out. Sometimes, sometimes I'll go to sleep too, but most of the nights, I just can't. I'm a night owl. Now, obviously, this is hot, so don't touch. <laughs> but, uh, mm, I can kind of touch that without burning. Hmm.
we're gonna let that sit that's what i do so i let this sit on my desk for it to cool down and then i'm gonna go in with this this one so what you do is you press these and then you put them on where it shows you on the sides and then i actually use low on this one or i actually have fan on here so the fan on here it starts to go cool and it'll cool your hair so i actually didn't know that this was a cooling function y'all i didn't even know that was a cooling function actually um i thought it was just high and low but i forgot there is a cooling function right here so i'm going to take that cooling function and go through and kind of lift up my hair so that way it's not too hot but it's also not wet anymore either it's dry which is crazy because that feels good See, it's always good to use the cooling function no matter what, even if you don't use this, because that way um, you can cool your um, hot tool. He's freezing on me. Is it just me? I don't know. Is it freezing on anyone else? I'm trying to think, am I connected to Wi-Fi? Well, I am, so maybe that's why. I don't know. It might be because of Wi-Fi. If anyone else is this freezing on you guys, let me know. See, and that way it cools this whole thing. See, this whole thing is not hot anymore. No, it's not freezing? Okay. So maybe jump out and jump back in. Mm. Y'all see the difference though? It's like, it's not wet anymore. It's just like very cool now. Yeah, I love, love this thing. I actually did not know there was a cooling function, though. Last time, I just left it the way it was. Now I know there's a cooling function. I didn't even look at that. I was, like, wondering what this thing was, but it has a little snowflake right here. It's either a snowflake or it's actually, like, saying there's a fan there, but um, I'm going to say it's a snowflake because uh, it's cooling, though, either way. Okay, and then I'm going to go through my hair one more time with this to make sure all my tangles are out. And y'all, I actually get faster, honestly. The first time I did it, I actually got faster. But because I'm on here and stuff, I kind of went a little slower. Because it is a little faster than what I, what I did. Oh, okay. Yeah, for a minute I was like, what? I'm back on my phone now. Oh, okay. So what do you guys think of that tool? Isn't that cool? I was shocked when I first used it because I was like, I was like, I don't know. I'm not sure if I want to get this one and... You know, I wasn't positive on it, and then um, I was like, well, I guess let me try it tonight, and if it doesn't work, I'll go take it back. And then I tried it the first night, and I was like, what? I was like flipping out, because I was like, Ray, look at this. <laughs> so funny. Fancy, but it looks huge. Yeah, it is pretty huge, but it isn't too bad. Compared to, where's that? Let me show you my Amazon curler. Uh, I haven't used it in a little while, but compared to my Amazon cool uh, Amazon curler, like it's more like big on the end here, but it actually thins out here. So, but this is my Amazon curler. Let me 
which I need to curl my hair again. I just haven't done it. Maybe I'll do that tomorrow. I don't know. I have extremely thin hair. Oh, do you? Yeah, that's how... <laughs> my hair. My hair is... I think it's both, if I remember correctly. I have extremely thin hair. How does the curler work? Um, so you power this on. Hold on. Here. So you power this on. And then you pick your mode here. And then um, either the left one or you do the right one. But all you do is you take your hair like this into that, into the barrel. And it sucks it in around this curler. And then when it beeps three times, then you go like this and it's curled. Used to be thick and beautiful, then I had... Oh, I'm sorry, love. Do you want me to show you how this works real quick? Because I can do a small bit to show you. I love this thing. It's on Amazon and stuff, and it is not bad of a price. It's like 40, shoot. I think it was like 46, if I remember correctly. Pretty sure it's 46. Does it pull your hair? No, it does not. Yes, um, the link is actually, I think it's in my link tree. Let me check. I'm pretty sure it's in my link tree. I'm so sorry, you guys. I don't know what just happened. <gasps> yes, please. Okay, yes, show you real quick. All right, I will show you. Just give me one second. Let me make sure that was in my link tree. Oh, okay, never mind. That's trying to do that. Chelsea, can you check if it's in my link tree? I think it is. Yeah, I can show you this real quick. It's really good. I love it. Oh, gosh. It's really simple to use, too. It beeps a lot. If you're one that maybe doesn't like the beeping so much, then maybe not get it. But I don't mind the beeping, so. One second. Let me see where my plug here. Oh, shoot. Come back here. Y'all, I'm yelling at the plug. I don't know why I did that. Okay, so what you do is you power it on. It beeps once. There is the little light here, so it tells you which temperatures. And you can do whatever you're wanting. The biggest one is 410. I don't recommend doing that. You can fry your hair. Um, all right. But the one I have it on right now is 374. I could even do 338. Um, and then the lowest is 302. I don't do the lowest only because my hair is a little hard to curl sometimes. So I do go up there on either the 338 or the 374. Which, I'm going to switch it back to 338 because that's what I had on last time. Um, Alright, so what you do is you go in, you take a small bit of your hair. Small bit. Not a big bit. If you put a big bit, um, it will maybe get, it will get stuck. But the, it, the thing was, is it does not pull your hair. If your hair gets stuck in this at all, it completely shuts off. So that you can easily take it out of here. Alright, so this is a barrel. Alright, y'all ready for this? Either go left way or you can go right way. Whichever one you want the curl to do. I'm going to go left. And you let it go. See it? It's turning. Um, it's going to stop and then you can let go of the button. And it's going to sit there. And when you hear the triple beep... You can go like this. Holy shit. Ooh, I don't even need it on that high, apparently. I thought I did. No, I don't. And there is your curl. You can do smaller. Let me do a smaller. Smaller piece. And you can go in. And you can do the same thing. And I'm going to do a right curl this time. And it takes in your hair.
let go of the button. Sometimes I forget. Triple beep. And you let it go. And it does that. Now if you go a higher heat or something like that, you might get a little bit of a more um, curly, curly curl if you want. But yeah, it does really pretty curls. There will be, by the way, because of the heat, you'll see the steam come off this a little bit. It's just because it's high heat or whatever. That's on any tool though. Okay, so I'm gonna go in here. Oh. Okay. Triple beep. And let out. Ooh, that was pretty. It was funny how this little, like, this little one did, though. Isn't that pretty? And then I'm going to power it off. And let it sit. So it can cool down. Or you could take a, um, what is it? You could take, like, an air, like, a blow dryer and put it on cool and then just kind of put it on that that way it um does that <laughs> so it cools down even faster you see that see this one did this curl because the way I had I had two sections on both sides so it did this one see it's pretty good all right I'm gonna put this back I'm going to plug this one back in and brush out that hair again. Because <laughs> it will drive me nuts if I leave it like that. Yeah, what do you guys think? I'll read the comment in a minute. Oh, gosh. Woo! Okay. So then I'm going to go in cool. Let's see if we can take that curl out, shall we? Still there. It's probably gonna stay there. <laughs> Those curls are probably gonna. Oh, this one pretty much got. Yeah, this one kind of got out. This one waved. Hold on. Let me see if I can. better it's still a little there like it's a little waved but y'all this is how my hair is natural it's like naturally waved anyway so it'll come back wavy anyway it's fine <laughs> will you quit getting her to how where did William go oh okay See, they stay pretty well. That just shows you how good they actually stay. This one is staying, but it's curling in between these other ones. So it looks funny. But yeah, they're not badly priced at all. Either one of them. I will tell you, I really love that Primrose one. And the Primrose one, like I said, comes with three pieces. So it comes with this one comes with this one, which apparently is for waves. This one, and then this one. And what this one does is it actually is supposed to curl the hair. I have not tested it out yet to curl it, but it definitely is amazing for blowing out my hair when it comes to it. So, any questions, you guys? Any questions? 
And y'all, this is dry. It is dry now. And this is not hot now. Wouldn't that be funny if it wasn't? Hmm. No. Um, but no, that is completely, completely dry now. Any questions? Any questions? Hello. Oh, look at what I got. What did you think I had? You know what I ought to do? Hold on. Let me see if I can do, use this thing. <laughs> nice, I can use it as a dryer too. Isn't that cool? Then I can use that as a hair dryer. Probably not intended to do that, but I don't care. I'm just drying this. That's funny though, that I can definitely use this as my dryer. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> I can use that as my hair dryer. That was funny. Wow, we picked up volume to that. Just by using this thing, just by using this air thing here, I literally just went boom. That works. All right, so I'm gonna put this back in here. Actually, I'll put the other one because I use that one. Maybe. Eh, I'll just put this one. But yeah, you guys, any questions for a hop off? I'm gonna set this aside. So it can fully, fully sit and make sure it's completely not hot or warm in general. Whew. But yeah, so that's how I use those. Any questions before I hop off? I hope you guys have a great rest of your night. No makeup tonight, cause like I said, it's late. I, I like I said, I had laundry and all the other stuff that I was doing, so I got a little sidetracked, but it's okay. I'll make sure I do a little bit of makeup and stuff tomorrow, because I have to technically get ready for the day anyway tomorrow, because I have to go up to, um, East skate or whatever it was. Have to go up there and stuff because we have to go put my put the Wi-Fi in my name. So we're gonna be out of Wi-Fi for a while, for a little while and stuff tomorrow. Um just because of having to go put it in my name. So but I hope you guys have a great rest of your night. If you guys have any questions for me at all about either that tool or the other tool um or any of that or makeup or any of that um anything at all just message me i hope you guys have a great rest of your night enjoy your night and i'll see you guys tomorrow bye